Time to go. situation it is 3 50 a.m here in Hartford Connecticut we're heading to Bradley Airport and Stacy and I are going to Cancun Mexico pretty excited this is our fifth time going down to Mexico and it's our third time staying in a Rio resort uh, we're staying in what the Rio, the Rio Palace Peninsula Cancun the kiddos didn't want to go on this trip you know Amber our driver right now is going to uh, college part-time and she also has a part-time job and the little one Kaylee um, they don't want to be the only kid going so Jennifer thank you for helping out watching Kaylee during the week and uh, yeah the weather forecast is beautiful we're gonna go for uh, nine days it's about 87 degrees every day down there so we're really, really pumped up for this trip. Uh, my buddy Chris and his girlfriend Jen are also going. This will be our third time going to Cancun with those guys. So it should be a fun week. Uh, our flight leaves at six o'clock from Hartford, Connecticut. We fly down to Atlanta, Georgia. And we go from Atlanta, Georgia, down to Cancun, Mexico. We land at 11.30 a.m. their time. So off to the airport. <laughs> just landed in Atlanta, Georgia, and we're trying to get to gate E4 right now for our connecting flight to Cancun. You excited? E4. Yes, I gotta go potty. <laughs> All right, got to E4 gate, and right now I'm doing a quick little time lapse right there of all these clouds out here. Oh boy, we are tired. It's only, what time is it? Like, like nine o'clock right now, I think? Yeah, this one slept the whole entire way down from uh, <laughs> from Hartford down to Atlanta. Shh, don't tell anybody. So, this next flight leaves at 9.56, and then we get down to Cancun at 11.30. I think there's like a one hour difference in time, though, so it's going to be a, you know, a couple hour flight, but one step closer to paradise. Hey, give them, give them a quick little update. What's, what's going on right now? So, they overbooked this flight. They need one person. To, you know wait till 4 30 today to leave they offered 400 dollars on the first round they went up to 800 dollars a minute ago now it's up to a thousand dollars it's a thousand dollars and i'm threatening to fly by myself and leave her down here and so i would we, kill him it's a thousand dollar gift card i can't go they can on pay the for half they pay for half our next trip i i, I understand it's a good amount of money but listen no. if it goes up to 1400 i'm getting in line no <laughs> 
Quick little update, we made it down. We just got out of customs, got our bags, private transportation. We're in the van right now. Our buddies from Amstar are bringing us to the Ryu Palace Peninsula. And it's only, what time is it, hun? 12.03. 12.03. Checked in. We got room 708 at the palace here, and we're heading up to our room right now. According to the bellboy, he says that room is sweet. All right, so this is the lagoon side of the hotel, right? And we are walking down to our room right now to see what it's all about. Hold on. Now it turned red. All right, here we are. I think the key goes on the uh... In the thing for the lights, oh, right? Well, it smells so good in here, doesn't it? It smells right here for the lights, right? Yep. Let's turn the light on. All right, so right now, a quick little fridge as you walk in. What's in the fridge, honey? In the fridge. Agua. Oh, yeah. Cerveza. A couple of cervezas, some, some beer, some agua. Soda or pop, as people call it. All right, a little Bacardi up top. Rum, vodka, whiskey, and tequila, it looks like. Wow, look at this, huh? Ooh, open up this blind. Like oh blind. my god. Oh, look at the bear on the bed. Oh, look at the little bear, huh? If you take my backpack off. Thanks. Thanks. All right, let's check this bad boy out. <laughs> look at this. Turn on some lights. If you can find them. Mm. That is a mark. Oh, there's some lights. All right. Down. Come down here. There you go, down. Closets with the safe. Big old bathroom. Look at the colors in here, huh? Oh, we got bathrooms. Man, <laughs> you in those bathrooms. I love them. They're comfy. All right. Sinks here. Oh, look at this little tub here. And let's head, uh, let's head outside. Let's see what's going on outside. I'm going to the shower. Let's go check it out. Is it the hair dryer? Okay, can we get it? No, hold on. Oh, there, oh, there you go. Wow, oh my goodness. Oh my god! Water. Oh yeah, nice tub for two right there. And then... Wow. I'm ready. Wow. Way out in the distance, that's I, I my header, so you can't probably see it. I'll zoom in after, but it's way out there. Look at that. And then, 
Wow. Right there's the Rio Caribe. We stayed there in 2010, 2011. I watched them start building these villas right here. And then here's a shot of the hotel with that famous Rio sign up there and the, uh, and the, the big square cut out. So very, very nice. Very happy with our room. All right, let's go down to the lobby and wait for Jen and Chris. All right, just got word that Jen and Chris are still in customs. So for now, we're gonna do a quick little time lapse and get this place unpacked and get it set up for the next nine days. While this one cracks her first beer. Mm. All right, made down to the lobby and we're having our first couple of margaritas here. And I believe Chris and Jen are just getting ready to pull in, which is pretty cool. There's, there's some, so, quick little shot of what the uh, lobby at the Rio Palace Pinto looks like. Pretty gorgeous. Pretty nice. There's my buddy Chris and Jen getting out right now. Yep. All right, just doing a quick little update. My boy Chris and his girlfriend Jen and Stacy were all here. They were on different flights. We're waiting for their room. Room, no food, eh? room 1624. They're on the top floor. My boy Julio hooked them up. That is Don Julio, that is. No, it was Diego. <laughs> Diego. It was Diego. But we can't wait to see their room. About 15, 20 minutes, we're going to head up there. If you see the Rio sign right, right up there, we're thinking that their room is like that corner. I think that's the room, like the corner room or that first room, 1624. As soon as I find out, you guys will find out. All right, guys, quick little update here. We're on the 16th floor at the Rio Palace Peninsula, and this is the view from Chris and Jen's room. So, Top so, floor at the hotel. Pretty amazing. This is uh, very, very nice. So. Our room is right on those uh, end corner. That's room 10 at the top, and we're on room 7. So we're like four four rooms down from there. That's where we're hanging out. And, uh, yeah, I think we're getting ready to go down and enjoy that water down there. We're just waiting for Chris and Jen's luggage to show up, and we're going to be on our way. All right, guys, it's about 4 o'clock. We're actually heading down for the first time right now to the beach. Got all our snorkeling gear, Chris and Jen. We're in their hotel room on the 16th floor, which is pretty wild. So we have dinner reservations tonight at what, seven o'clock? It's seven o'clock at Cristal. So I'm gonna go do a bit of snorkeling. Water is cold right now. That's why I'm not in there. It's like uh, overcast and raining right now, but uh, tomorrow's a different day, so we'll see what happens. Right now we're just chilling, having a couple of beers, and waiting for Chris and Jenny to get down here. <clears throat> I'm shooting this with a GoPro camera. The good, the good camera's upstairs uh, charging, so it, it's very pretty. I'm not going to lie to you. In fact, it's so pretty, I'm probably better off doing a time-lapse video while we're waiting for everybody. So let's give it a shot. <laughs> so they have all this coral that keeps coming in. Coral doesn't come in. Coral just sits here. But look at this. Look at this one. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that on coral. So neat.
All right, just got done doing a little bit of snorkeling and we're going to change our towels in for new dry towels. Heading back to the room, we have dinner plans for seven o'clock. So just a quick little update. All right guys, it's been a long day. We're pretty tired, long day of traveling. And we have a full week here at the Ryu Palace Peninsula in Cancun. We're very excited about that. Gonna try to vlog a few times while we're down here and just capture a bunch of beautifulness about this uh, country and this, and this hotel and everything else. So for now, vlog number 40 is all done.